Hey, anybody care for a nice warm beer? <laughs> Me neither. I've told you about my favorite things to taste, and now it's time to tell you about my least favorite things to taste. I don't have to eat them now during this video, do I? <laughs> anything from the pig, anything at all. I don't like it. I just, ooh, it grosses me out. Bacon, ham, a pork roast, any of that stuff, man. No thank you. Broccoli. I mean, when I was a kid, my parents made me eat that stuff, but I swore I'd never would again. Asparagus just stinks so much. It smells up the whole house. And I've tasted it a couple of times. No, 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 please no. Wax beans is one that my father made me eat one time. And I remember I sat at the table till must have been 10 o'clock at night. And I finally ate them ice cold. Dad showed me, didn't he? <laughs> Cauliflower is another one. Just nasty. Ooh. Just thinking about it turns my stomach a little bit. Pepper, right? From the shaker. You know, I put salt on everything, but uh, I don't use pepper. I, I just don't like the way it tastes. It just doesn't do anything for me. Nuts of any kind, walnuts, peanuts, pistachios, cashews, any of that stuff, man. Ooh, just the texture of it and just the taste of all of it. I, ooh. Caraway seeds, the thing that makes rye bread taste the way it does. Not for me. I mean, I'll tell you what, you want to ruin a sandwich quick? <laughs> Put it on rye bread. <laughs> Cheese of any kind, no thank you, not for me. I, you know, just the smell and the taste of it together, and that texture too, it's just all strange in my mouth. I don't want it. There's this fruit that's very popular in China. It's called durian, and I've had it twice in my life, and that is two times too many. You know what this tastes like? It tastes like what you think a baby's diaper smells like. It is just disgusting. Coffee is something I don't drink. A lot of people think it's very strange. But my mother, when I was about seven or eight years old, I said to her, hey, Ma, can I try this? And she goes, sure, kid, knock yourself out. And that's the last time I ever had it. I just don't like it. I can't drink it, it just makes me gag. You know what tastes horrible? It's this liqueur from Iceland, it's called Opal. Oh my God, it is just, oh, I, I can't even begin to tell you what it tastes like. Although by about the fourth or fifth shot, it's fine. You don't even notice. <laughs> Sambuca is sort of in that same family, right? It's that black licorice kind of thing. I, I never got it, I don't like it. Jägermeister is one of those too. You know, it's very popular and stuff, but I, I don't know, I just never did shots of that stuff. Even Black Good and Plenty's, right? Anything with that flavor in it. I don't know what it is, but I can't stand that flavor. There's even beers I don't like. You know, I always say if it's for free, it's for me, but one of those dark heavy beers, oh, oh no thank you. Or a porter or a stout, oh man, no. Milk is one I never liked. You know, as a kid, you're supposed to drink milk and everything, my parents always tried to make me do it, but. I just never got into it. I could never dig the taste of it. Not even in my cereal, you know? I'd, I'd rather have a dry than put milk in it. <laughs> coconut, oh my God, no, thank you. It's funny, I like the smell of coconut, but I just can't stand the taste of it. it it's awful. That's how you ruin a birthday cake. <laughs> the taste, the feel of cotton. The fabric of our lives. The taste? <laughs> I know. <laughs> I just want to sing like Aaron Neville, that's yeah. all.